Hello everyone, my name is Jared Decker and today we are going to touch back on the color issues with printing from the Adobe Lightroom to a Canon Pro 100. I previously made a video with my Band-Aid fix, which you can find here, but I received confirmation on the issue from a paper supplier and I wanted to explain what I have found. Before we dig in, if you wouldn't mind liking the video and considering subscribing to the channel, it would help me out and keep these videos coming. So I took over a printing company a couple months ago that's called phototocanvas.com. Since then, I've been doing a large amount of printing, but I'm doing it all using a Canon Pro 4000 and an IPF 900 professional large format roll printers. I do the majority of the work on the Canon Pro 4000, and I can't say enough awesome things about that machine. It's just fantastic. And I do most of my printing with Adobe Photoshop, but I did find myself needing to use the Pro 100 with Lightroom and I'd like to tell you what happened. So a customer ordered 67 five by seven prints, all different photos, and it sounded like a nightmare to load them all into Photoshop and nest them onto one large sheet. But my colors are spot on with the Pro 4000, so I really wanted to use it. So Adobe Lightroom made it very easy, and you can see how I did that here. So I used Lightroom to print to my Pro 4000, and it worked great. The colors were dead on, but then came the trouble. When I was cutting the prints, I messed up and I ruined one. So I needed to reprint one 5x7, which I can't do on the Pro 4000. So this sent me back to printing to my Pro 100. And having just printed from Lightroom to the Pro 4000 successfully, I followed the exact same workflow and had the same old color issues. So I decided to reach out to the paper manufacturer. I'm a big fan of Red River Papers, and I'll put a link to them in the description below. So I sent them some screenshots and they actually called me back to walk me through the process and make sure I was doing everything right. When I was talking to the rep, he told me that this was a known issue. The Pro 100 is the most popular printer they make paper for. And for some reason, sometimes only on a Mac, it double profiles. So the process is putting Canon's color management on top of the Red River profile. And now when I pick Canon's color management, the colors are, aren't bad as I showed in my other video, meaning it does not double profile. But when I pick the Red River profile, it double profiles. So to make sure it wasn't the Red River profile, I used the same method with my breathing color paper and their profile on the Pro 100. And I have the same problem. So Lightroom with a Mac and a Canon Pro 100 has an issue. And from my test, the issue seems to be with the Canon Pro 100 print driver. Yet Canon has not addressed this and it's been a problem for years. So I don't have a solid solution. I used Canon's color management in the situation I was in and it was fine. The photo fortunately didn't have a ton of bright colors, but I could see it being a bigger issue down the line if I have to do this regularly. So please, if you have any input or solutions, post it in the comments below. Canon, if you see this, get your together. Help us here, at least acknowledge the problem. So I'll keep you updated as I work on this. I do talk to Canon support fairly regularly and I'll bring it up next time I talk to him. So if this helps you out, please give the video a thumbs up. I know I don't have the proper fix, but hopefully this at least saves you some time, some ink, some paper, and some sanity. That's all for now. I'll see you next time. Stay safe and stay healthy. Thanks.